<laughs> okay, this is it, right down here. Yeah, it's right down the hallway here. Yeah. This is where it all happened in the summer of 1971. Right down this corridor in the basement of the psychology department is where we converted these offices and storage rooms to prison cells. And we had students like yourself, college students from all over the country, play the roles of either prisoners or guards. This was the yard, the prison yard. Uh, here in this closet was solitary confinement, the infamous hole where the guards put uh, prisoners for punishment. That part was screened off, and there was a hidden camera that we recorded everything that happened, exactly where the video crew is now. Here's one of the rooms that was a cell. In fact, I have a box of old stuff from the experiment I'd like you to see. Hmm. Now, here's a box with an old memorabilia from our study, the, the sign. This is one of the prisoner's uniform, prisoner, prisoner 819. You can see it's really a dress. Here are the chains that the guards gave, made the prisoners wear to remind them of their status. The military uni kind of uniforms the guards wore, their billy club, symbols of power and authority. And you can see over in the wall, one of the prisoners etched the days of the week to mark the passage of time, starting on Sunday, Monday, through the rest of the week. Well, how long did the study last? Well, we were going to run it for two weeks, but we had to end it after only six days. What was that? Prisoner 819 did a bad thing. Prisoner 819 did a bad thing. Prisoner 819 did a bad thing. Prisoner 819 did a bad thing.